Hello, welcome to Know About Chef. Today we are at Great Haywood, which is kind of right in the middle of the country if you don't know where it is. I'll put a map up. <laughs> but today we're at Great Haywood, specifically the junction at Great Haywood where the canals um, meet. So you've got the Trent and Maisie Canal, which joins with the Staffordshire and Worcestershire Canal. At this junction is a hire boat company called Anglo Welsh, and it's the Great Haywood base. This is the base that my parents first hired their canal boat from, and it's how we got a taste of narrowboat life. So if it weren't for them hiring from Great Haywood, we likely wouldn't be sitting here talking to you now about living and travelling on our narrowboat. <laughs> you wouldn't get this awesome content <laughs> <laughs> so they were kind enough to actually sit down with us and answer some questions that we had about hiring narrowboats so if you're thinking about having a narrowboat holiday this video is for you we do from 2 to 12 births depending obviously on the um, size of the party and, and who uh, consists of the party then we can advise you as, as to the layouts, bed layouts, requirements, um, anything like that. But yeah they're, they're fairly spaced out and big 12 bursts ideally yeah you, you need to sort of get get along and know each other quite well um, yeah, for the size of the boat. We provide everything from the bedding, towels, um, tea towels, stuff like that so we'll, ideally we, we, we tell customers to bring as, as themselves the food and the drinks. Um, Basic provisions, relief, uh, torch for night times. Um, take a chance with the weather, bring your wellies and your waterproofs, umbrellas. Hopefully not too much, but yeah. We have quite a strategic handover procedure that we give to every customer, regardless of whether they're new or not. If you've never done it before, so the newbies, as you call them, then we take them through the boat. Uh, we will tell them absolutely everything, how, how the light switches work, how everything works, just so they are confident um, with when they obviously get back in the daytime and night times, uh, they know where things are. We will take them through absolutely everything from the engine um, to how the boat works, the cookers. Um, we will take them out, teach them how to drive. We'll take them through the first lock, whichever way they go at Grey Haywood. If they're not confident with that, then we'll, we'll go with them a bit further. We will basically be with them as long as they need um, until they're ready to sort of let us go, really rather than the other way around. That's what we found the first time we hired. We had a lovely gentleman take us to the first lot. Yeah. yeah. And we did. We had no idea what we were doing, so it was really great. <laughs> there, there is a lot to take in, especially with the handover and, and the lock tuition, especially if it, it's busy and there's people around as well. They like to give their own sort of input. Um, but everything, we, we've got a cracking boat manual, boat manual reference guide on every single boat we've got that will take you through in black and white. So, yeah, if they, if they ever think we've missed anything, I haven't explained it enough, it's always there. Mm. And... Yeah, we're never going to be far away either, so we're always on hand. We get a lot of customers who will watch the, the videos, the DVDs, um, and, and YouTube as well. Um, sometimes I think it might be better just come in blind and let us teach you what you need to know, rather than what somebody thinks you, you should know beforehand. Um, it, it's probably not a bad idea getting an idea of what the locks look like. I mean, the amount of customers we get where they they think they're all um, well, they've seen pictures and they think they're all all massive, absolutely incredibly huge things and quite daunting. Um, where they can be quite simplistic and and yeah, they're not that deep and they're not that big and they're not that scary. So sometimes it's best just to uh, just to come in blind or otherwise just yeah, have a quick look and see what what a range of locks look like. There's not an age restriction uh, as long as anyone's under the age of 18, as long as there's an adult on the back with them to supervise, but you do need to be 18 to actually hire a boat. You can, yes. Yeah, we, uh, first pet's free. Um, after that, it's £25. Um, it, it's, it's common knowledge in that you, you've got to bring your dog with you. Of course you have, <laughs> yes. Four counties ring is the most popular route. Yeah. If you want to do a week's ring, uh, the only other one would be the Black Country Ring. Um, otherwise, it's out and back routes from Great Haywood. Um, down to Starport is, is a very nice route. Um, very countryside, um, nice places to see, pops to stop off at. Um, 
for the less adventurers there is down to Wolverhampton, up to Market Drain and back. Um, that's a more leisurely week, yeah, but again, a lot of countryside. You can, yeah, when you book the boat, if you look through the brochure or actually on the website it will tell you the stern arrangements of, uh, of, of the boats. The booking office will, will advise you as well. Um, yeah, from, from a trad to a semi-trad to, to a cruiser stern. Uh, we have 10 of our own and we operate uh, like an agency for Silsden Boats up in Skipton. In 2018 we had 509 uh, bookings and 1,255 people came through the yard on holiday with us. Why would you take a narrowboat holiday as opposed to any other sort of holiday? Because it's awesome, I guess. <laughs> it's it's really the pace of the pace of the holiday. Like it's yeah. so different. You, you can you take your co accommodation with you, which yeah. gives you the unique um, ability to be able to spend as much time exploring a specific place in the English countryside if you like it more, not being pushed by a certain schedule, schedule yeah it's or just so peaceful and quiet yeah. and you can moor up pretty much anywhere if you find a nice spot and you think yeah this is a good spot to stay the night you just stop there you can get right into the center of a city like Birmingham if you hired a boat and just went into the city of Birmingham you can stay there for several days for free so it's it's unique and we would recommend everybody who wants to try something different try an Arab boat holiday yeah very relaxing yeah this video wasn't sponsored by anglo welsh it just has a special place in our hearts because it was the first place we hired an airboat from and it's just very interesting <laughs> yeah <laughs> and we just wanted to kind of pay it back um yeah Ang anglo welsh is a great company to hire from they do a really great orientation when you first get on the boat yeah and the even, first time we hired yeah. it they took us to a lock to show us how to, to, show operate, us how to operate it because we had no idea we were complete newbies so definitely recommend them <laughs> we hope this video is giving you some ideas for your future holidays and please like and subscribe and we'll see you <laughs> next time bye bye What do you see, Pixel? I see the puppy playing with a ball. <laughs> <laughs>